Namaste, this is Mekla here from Pujas.in. In today's video, I'd like to address a question which I think all of us have in our minds. Uh, somewhere we want it, but we don't know how to go for it. Um, that is instant prosperity. So I received an email uh, from a lady. So she wanted to know if we have any remedy where uh, you know there's something like instant prosperity, like at the click you get money. Well, um, I have received very good feedback on certain uh, items that we have, which are sacred items, like the dravya. I have made a video earlier on that. You can watch it; it's there in our playlist. Okay, wherein you know people have procured that, that, and then they have seen instant prosperity. Then we have also done pujas of Lakshmi Ashtodra Shatanamavali, wherein within six weeks we have seen very good results, and people have started seeing income coming every week. Of the puja being performed, but uh, there is nothing like instant like this. Yeah, but in the dravya, what I mentioned to you, the Lakshmi dravya, there I have seen that people have got instant prosperity. But uh, you know, it again means certain things are expected from you. So when you actually do certain things, you will see good results in terms of prosperity. Now, what are the things that you need to do every day, no matter what? Pray to your Kula Devata. Then pray to your Ishta Devata. You will have some god as your favorite. So pray to your Ishta Devata also. Now the third thing is lighting lamps. I have mentioned in my very first video on Pujas Dot in YouTube channel. If you see that you have to light lamps. So lighting lamps with til oil is very very important every day, and lighting ghee lamps at least twice a week, Tuesdays and Fridays, is again very very auspicious. So these are the things which you need to do must and should. Next thing is that whenever you visit any temple, make sure you put some amount of money inside the hundi. Hundi is nothing but the donation box in a temple. So whenever you put money in a hundi, what exactly happens is it's like a karmic filter. That's what my guru always says. So the moment you put money inside, a lot of your negative karma gets absorbed. You get cleansed, and then definitely you can start seeing. a uh, progress because lot of blocks in your path of progress is released so pro- when blocks are released prosperity is definitely a sure shot thing to achieve okay then uh, another thing that you could do is and and i won't say you could i i will say you should do is offering flowers to the deities at home so if you have a small puja mandir at home just offer flowers every day i am telling you don't say that we are working professionals don't say we are we don't have time don't say uh, we can't get flowers here because i know for sure that even people who live abroad are getting flowers every day and they are offering flowers and they're doing very well in their life the more you act stingy towards divinity the more you will not receive the more you give the more you receive so you have to learn to balance your finances in a way like even if you want to cut down on your other expenses do it it's worth it because offering flowers to divinity is very very important offer flowers to divinity at home every day light the loy lamps every day light ghee lamps at least twice a week if you are lighting ghee lamps every day very good then every sankashtahara chaturthi which falls every month you get sankashtahara chaturthi lot of temples ganesha temples particularly will offer some puja for ganesh ji give your name even if it's a samuhik puja never mind go and give your name for the sankashtahara chaturthi puja it will really help you a lot yeah, every full moon i'm sure lot of temples do satyanarayan katha go and give your names for the satyanarayan katha there get a puja done because satyanarayan katha is something which you do mainly to offer like a thanksgiving you know express your gratitude to divinity for what you have with this in mind when you give you will again receive more from divinity So please make a note because this video is more like you know pointers that you will receive from this video is going to be useful for all your life and even if you have your children living abroad if you have your family members living abroad you can just tell them wherever they are they can practice this all temples do sankashtahara chaturthi all temples do satyanarayan katha if they don't do you can approach us we will get it done for you that's not a problem and offering incense to god the agarbattis when you show it to the gods and you know move it around all the rooms in your house that cleanses the vibrations the negativity uh, inside the house so every evening and every morning if somebody in the house whoever is there can do it then the whole area is energized you get fresh ideas you get fresh inputs you feel very good and uh, you know you get a lot of ideas to uh, prosper so mental blocks are released basically 
and uh, during navratris if you can call sumangalis married women or kanyas in girls who have not yet attained their puberty if you call them home and give them gifts at least buy them gifts once in a year where you give them shringar items like bindis and uh, dresses lehengas lehenga cholis bangles you know because they are nothing but the divine mother's avatar so when they come because they are innocent mother will come through them so mother is mahakali mahalakshmi mahasaraswati so if you want instant prosperity you need to think in that instant way that yeah okay it is this don't always equate money to lakshmi you need to have brains to earn money that is required with the grace of uh, you know uh, mahalakshmi mahasaraswati you get the brains to actually earn money second thing is you need to perform some actions to again earn money you need to work and that work is through parvati she is kriya shakti and mahalakshmi is the final end result that you get you get peace peace is also mahalakshmi wealth is mahalakshmi prosperity is mahalakshmi so you know when you call the kanyas or when you call the um, sumangalis the devi comes in their form and they bless you so call them to your house or you go to a devi temple and see randomly if you find kanyas or sumangalis and then offer these things so these are very good and at pujas dot in at the behest of uh, you know devotees requests or clients requests we do perform karnika puja and sumangali puja particularly we do this during the navratris we get navratri four times a year and we do it all the four times but even other than that if people have stri shapa or stri dosha curse of a lady from the past or in the present life then we do organize sumangali puja and kanika puja in a very grand way and even after performing this people have seen instant prosperity instant results although i would not uh, like to call it instant because there's nothing called instant it's not an instant coffee to you know have resi- like that but then if you make a conscious effort from here the time starts clicking from the time you start thinking in a positive way you start like moving in the direction so you make one step divinity will move 10 steps closer to you so just start moving in the direction i'm 100% sure you will start seeing results and you will start feeling in your heart that this is happening very instantaneously so the moment i did this remedy i saw the result that's how you're going to feel so i think uh, pretty much i've covered a lot of things things that you need to do daily things you need to do uh, at least a couple of times in a month and also things that you need to do uh, a couple of times in a year so like every day is lighting diyas and offering flowers every month is sankashtahara chaturthi and satyanarayan katha then once in a year or at least four times a year is the sumangali puja and the kanika puja you know try these things and let me know give me your feedback we are practicing it we are feeling that we are prosperous we are feeling that we are at peace we are feeling very blissful and i'm so sure that you know if you practice you'll also feel the same and once you feel don't keep the secret to you just share it with people you know that will also bring in prosperity the more you give the more you share the more you get with that i'd like to sign off on this video thank you so much namaste